Hello, thanks for watching and welcome. So in this video, I'm going to I'm going to um, give a kind of an orientation what you should be, you know, focused on as soon as you get started with Live Good. And people are asking, what can I do to get on, uh, get started in the right way so that I can have immediate success? And yes, that's what this video video is about. How are you going to get immediate success with Live Good? What you need to be focused on? What you need to be doing the first day of launching your business here with Live Good? Because guys, I don't want you to uh, misunderstand what we've got here. You know, yes, it is a ten dollar a month uh, business, but uh, that doesn't mean that this is just some kind of rinky dink business. This is a a million dollar business, and it'll you know it'll pay you whatever you know whatever you decide to do with it. You know, it's a vehicle. And um, when I got on board, literally eleven months ago, um, it was sort of bang on. I'm bang on about eleven months when I joined, twenty third of December two thousand twenty two, and I've made over ninety thousand. Uh, dollars with this with live good uh, my team has um, lo- um, is well over over well over 90,000 members in the team um, and um, you know I've built up to leadership ranks I'm now a platinum rank and the, uh, the reason why I'm not diamond yet is um, not that I'm complaining I mean the the income is incredible even at platinum when you when you've built up a team um, you know, of a you know good size, and 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 you're you know you're focused, and you're working hard, and you're working towards the diamond, and you're you know you're literally knocking on the door of of diamond, like I am. You know, you you could easily be earning ten thousand dollars per month. Uh, you know, plus even at the platinum level, that's very very possible um, for for people like you know who like myself who are near the diamond level. But certainly, when you get to diamond, you're going to be you know getting to $10,000 and and way over $10,000 plus, you know, and up. Um, so, you know, why am I saying all this? Now, a little disclaimer, um, you know, my results are not typical. And, um, you know, definitely, you know, with people, you know, with the right attitude and getting on board in the right way and getting the right guidance and the line of support that you're going to be able to get access to. And, and, you know, Guys, I mean, if you're if you're watching this video and you're already on board and you feel that your sponsor is not supporting you or someone in the upline is not supporting you, we've got everything we ha- we need here, and I'm going to give you that orientation. So if you even if you're not in my downline or team, you can watch this video and you can learn, um, you know, what you need to learn in order to get started in the right way. And if you've been on board for a while and you haven't gotten started yet, or you feel you haven't gotten the guidance so far, that's okay. Just um, follow on with this video. And, um, you know, you'll find out that uh, actually you can easily get plugged in regardless of what your sponsor is doing. You know, never, ever, you know, put your whole put your whole kind of future or your or game plan or your business journey into the hands of your sponsor. You know, yes, your sponsor is there to help. And if you've got a good sponsor who's supporting you, you're blessed. Absolutely. But, uh, you know, it's all down to you. And, uh, you know, you, you you decide you the boss, you know. So we've got the lucky thing. What we've got here is we've with Live Good, as I'm going to explain, is we've got everything we need. We've got the weekly webinars, the Zooms, the lives. We've got uh, we've got all the groups that you can be uh, getting access to, and I'll show you how you get access to that. Even if you're not in my downline, I'll give you access to the seven day fast start guide. Um, and I don't mind you getting into the Facebook group, which I which I'm uh, admin of, um, and you can uh, you know you know get access to that. So really. Sometimes you know if you if your sponsor's just doing nothing and uh, not supporting you, fine. You don't need that. You know you you know you can get everything you need with what I'm going to explain. So yeah, we're on the, uh, November twenty first uh, today, two thousand twenty three. Um, this month, November, typically, you know, a, a kind of a slow month in network marketing. Um, but this month has been crazy. You know, guys, um, in just three weeks. Guys, three weeks, okay, of November. We're at the twenty-first of November. Just three weeks. My team has brought on almost nine thousand members. Okay, eight thousand eight hundred members, whatever it is. Yeah, eight thousand eight hundred members um, in this last three weeks. Um, these are brand new members came on board within the team, and uh, you know that's just within the last three weeks. So you know what I'm. What I mean by this, I mean. Guys, I'm not trying to brag or anything, and okay? my results are not typical. You know, you put in the work, and you're willing to follow simple instructions, and you know, you take advantage of what we've be, what we've been given here, with the website and the back office and all the tools that we've got here. You can make this happen, 
And don't think for a second, don't think that you need to have some kind of fancy marketing system or whatever. Yes, I've provided those in the past. But honestly speaking, you know, I'm an analytical kind of guy. I really dig down deep into the numbers uh, and I see a lot of what's going on. Guys, I'm number seven on the leaderboard of a company here, which is over 850,000 members. OK, and I'm number five. Uh, no, sorry, number seven, uh, top re top performer, top recruiter in the in the company. OK, and I do. I anal and I analyze things. I'm analytical and and I can see, you know, and I'm adapting my business strategy based on what I think the team needs. And I've kind of moved away from, you know, the, the, the actual need really for marketing systems, although they're great and and they work. And if you're using them, great. But don't don't get your, you know, you know, if you're someone who's not really into that kind of thing or haven't been using that kind of thing, don't think for a second that that's going to be your your maker for, for your success. Um, because definitely not. I mean, you know, you'll, you'll, you can look at the leaders, you can look at the diamonds, the people above me, the people in my line of support, people, people, the leaders in LiveGood, really none of them are using a, any kind of marketing system, you know, or any third party marketing system. The marketing system's built in. We've got the lead capture pages. And then, you know, I get people saying with excuses saying, well, everyone's seen those those pages already. Well, guys, you're not in, you know, we're not marketing in that way. What we're doing is we're having conversations with people. You really do need to have a conversation with people. You need to network with people. You need to, um, you know, you need, you need to build up those relationships. Once you've done that and you're starting to get that, you know, build up that know, like and trust and, and they're starting to warm up to you. Regardless of what they, you know, whether they, whether they've actually seen the, 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 the website that you've shared, that you're sharing out right here or not is irrelevant uh, or this one sorry the uh, the free tour website which is right on the bottom of your of your uh, back office live good what, you know it, it makes no, no no difference you know they've already, they're going to be they're joining you all right it's a people business they've they've connected with you they want to join you um, potentially you know they're excited yes you, there's going to be some some resistance obviously there typically is you're going to be you're going to be um, following up with people. You're going to have to nudge people. You're going to have to work with people. Sure, absolutely. Um, and don't be afraid to to you know resolve those issues with people because you know they are asking you questions. And and guys, I've been in this industry for a long time, but not not as long as some people. But it doesn't matter. The point is that I've been in the trenches for long enough, and I've I've had those conversations with people, and I have found that just because people are opposing what I'm saying. They're not actually communicating in that way. They're actually trying to do their due diligence. They actually, deep down inside, often want you to resolve those issues. So don't or don't just leave people alone too much. I mean, yes, you don't want to be persistent. You don't want to be, um, you know, too much in in the in their face. But um, you know, just be gentle and be focused, and you know, come across as being obviously passionate about what you're doing. Um, but you, you know you can be civil and you can be um, you know use uh, use plenty of tact. You know you've got to be tactful, uh, and that's how you build up relationships. People really respect you if you use a lot of tact. You know be very tactfulness. Um, so you know help people, guide people, support people. Use posture. Posture is so essential. Um, <clears throat> you know I'm sure I, I do sponsor a lot of people. People do say that oh it's all right for you. You know, you could go into someone's inbox and, and boom, you know, not necessarily. You know, a lot of people have never heard of me and I do go in people's inboxes. Yes. And I do have an air of um, confidence. Yes, sure. It helps when you've already built up that team. That's why you need to do a certain amount of creative visualization. You need to do some goal setting. You need to revisit your reasons why every single day. I mean, I, I you know, I personally, I actually, you know, I, I do goal setting multiple times a day. I've got uh, my vision boards up i've got my um statements around my 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 room um these are personal statements about you know my goals i'm i'm just you know always reminding myself my reason why yes i do have a very very strong reason why uh and i keep reminding myself of that and that's one of the reasons why i stay so passionate so motivated and regardless of what people think about me what regardless of the responses i get from people even if there's a lot of hatefulness or or discourage you know a lot of people who are discouraging uh, and uh, you know hate what I'm saying or whatever it doesn't matter you know I just push on and you have to because your dreams are so that so much more important 
than what are pe- whatever people are going to say. So uh, keep pushing, keep pushing forward. Because just imagine, guys, I mean, you know, here you are here, uh, we, you know, getting started with Live Good, and whether you started already, whether you're thinking about getting started, we're still in the first year. All right. And what I want to say next is a true story. I joined Skinny Body Care, which is the previous company that uh, Ben Glinsky launched uh, in 2010. I launched, I, I, I got in in 2010. When it launched, pre-launched, I was in immediately. I got invited by um, an American guy who was actually a friend of mine who was also based in Japan. He, he was a successful guy running his own businesses and stuff like that. He was very much into diversification and uh, he, you know, I respected him and he told me about Skinny Body Care have a look at this. So I did. And I got on board. I was already in the network marketing space. I had some, you know, some good things happen, some not so good things happen like the rest of us. There were some rug pulls. But I, you know, I thought that these products were great. Uh, I had been in Amway before. And, you know, these this kind of network marketing company, you know, was something I I, I could, uh, I could feel that, you know, was more likely to to last um, compared to the, you know, the passive income type businesses that I was, you know, looking at you know, which were, which were not really, you know, trustworthy. Um, so, you know, I was looking for something that was not so much of like a get rich quick scheme. I was looking for something more with tangible products, more, you know, obviously more visual, more, more, you know, something that would uh, give me more, more hope. And that's what live, uh, what's, that's what skinny body care did. But, you know, I didn't stick at it. You know, I, I came in, I, I, I got out after a few, several months, I, I just quit. I mean, I couldn't uh, make it happen. You know, I, I, and I regret that. I really regret that. Obviously, you know, the, these things, they take a lot, they get, they take time and effort to build. Absolutely. But it's, it's an accomplishment that is worth your while. Absolutely. But I did. I, I quit after three months. And then soon after that, I actually quit in 2011, the entire industry. So I got out of the network marketing industry. I got I got out of uh, looking at opportunities online. I got completely out of it totally. And I just spent my um, the next seven, five years, um, four or five years, um, you know, doing my local stuff in Japan. Uh, and that was it. Um, <clears throat> so I didn't even keep in touch with anyone in, within the industry. I, you know, I, I had built up a list, I had built up a following, but uh, I lost touch with everyone. And the only person I stayed in touch with was one guy um, who was who just continued to do well. But I didn't pay any attention to what he was doing. He was on Facebook, and he was do, you know he was running these Skype groups, and I got out of those all you know completely. But when I got back on, uh, but I got back in the industry because I did come across his um, Twitter feed. And he was talking about something that looked quite interesting. So I got on board with him. But he was the only guy I, I stayed in touch with within the industry. And I, I literally had to start from scratch. That was in 2015 when I got back into the industry. Um, and, um, you know, I followed him for a while. But then, you know, he was mostly focused on sort of the crypto stuff and the passive income stuff. So I I didn't keep in touch with a lot of that stuff. But I did, I, I did work with a few of those kind of businesses. A lot of them just didn't work. In fact, Every single one of them I got involved in pretty much, you know, basically didn't work for more than a year or two years. And there have been one or two have been lasting a long time. And, you know, but uh, I wanted, you know, I didn't get into this industry, you know, from hopping around and jumping around. Um, So anyway, in 2016, after having been back in the industry for a whole year, roughly, I got back in and and I came across, you know, some other guy um, told me about, skinny body care again now obviously i had joined skinny body care 10 uh sorry on the 2010 which was six years before now in 2016 i um i took another look at it because i was introduced to it again and i suddenly thought i recognize this i recognize the product i recognize the website you know interesting and they've been going for six years already and i recognize some of the names i recognize tim miller um and um so i got i i got in I, i mean you know i i I am into. I, I did get back into in and out of fitness and and health and wellness, and this was very passionate to me. This, you know, I could build a story around this. You know, my own journey, my passion, um, and obviously network marketing and bridging those two together. You know, and uh, I could I could really feel I could promote something like this. So I got back in. Um, this was, uh, you know, obviously one year after I got back into the industry. So you know, I'd build. I'd been building things up, and so I got back in and. And guys, you know, literally within three months of joining that company, 
uh, joining Skinny Body Care after three months in 2016, I went diamond in that company. You know, I was on the leaderboard of that company. Um, in you know, I joined I joined Skinny Body Care in in uh, May, the middle of May, uh, 2016. So it was the, it was in the middle of the month. I joined late, but even by the end of that first month, I was right at the top of the leaderboard. I was above people. I was way. I was above people like Aaron Parker and Kylo. And I was above, you know, people like Justin Clark and, um, you know, Tyson Curtis and people like that. I was I was right at the top of the leaderboard. I think I had about 132 people sponsored in my first month in that company. And people came into my inbox and said, I've never even heard of you. You know, you're not even doing Facebook. You're not even doing Instagram or anything. Well, I don't think Instagram was, a vet, was around that back then. But, um, but uh, you know, I just made my journey. Why am I, why am I telling you all this? I'm just telling you all this because... You know, with a company that's been going for six years already, guys, you know, do you see what I'm t trying to say to you guys? A company had been going already for six years. I quit. I quit the industry. I started back in the industry in 2015 with zero followers. I had to start all over again. And one year in back into the industry, I joined Skinny Body Care again. And then guess what? I went diamond in three months. So don't tell me, guys, that you can't do it. Don't tell me that, you know, you think that I'm lucky. You know, I've been an, uh, I've been a newbie. I've proven, you know, that uh, it's possible. I'm not saying that you need to be at the top of the leaderboard. I'm not saying you, you, you need to be, um, you know, like a big rah-rah kind of guy. I'm shy. I live in Japan. You know, I'm surrounded by people who don't even speak my language, you know, locally. I have to resort to online methods in order to talk to people freely. Yes, my Japanese is not bad. Um, and yes, in spite of that, I actually have a team here in Japan of over, you know, over 1,500 plus 1,600 people here in Japan anyway, um, here in LiveGood. But, uh, you know, I, I mostly resort to, you know, global methods. You know, we've got social media, we've got YouTube, we've got uh, other methods that we can we can resort to uh, in order to, you know, overcome the fact that, um, you know, I wasn't going to make excuses just for the fact that I don't know people around my local area or people in my local area don't speak my language. I, I could have made those excuses, guys. I've, I've heard every single excuse that you could make and they don't mean anything to me because I've got those excuses. I didn't finish university. I don't, I don't have a, you know, a university degree. I got into catering when I, when I got out of school because that was you know all I could do is my dyslexia wasn't going to allow me to get an office job or anything like that. That was the cool thing to do, but I couldn't do that. So I, I got into catering. I got into uh, being a cook, um, chopping vegetables, peeling potatoes. That's what I did. Um, but I love I love traveling. So I, 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 th I figured that everyone needed to eat. So I, and, you know, regardless of my language ability, I could be around the world and I could I could uh, cook. I started with Hong Kong and I went out to Hong Kong. I, I went out to various places and I, I spent the rest of my adult life based in Asia. I went to Japan. I've been in Japan for over 20 years so uh, you know, you know, I'm dyslexic, guys. You know, I, I, um, you know, I could make all the excuses, um, and um, you know, but but some, you know, we all started as a newbie somewhere, um, and we, we make it happen. But anyway, you know, now, you know, I wanted to say, I wanted to tell you that simply because I feel that it's relevant because people are saying that you know we haven't even hit one year yet in Live Good. Um, and, we, and people are saying people think it's saturated. It's far from saturated. You're a million miles away from saturation, if that even even ever exists. Okay, there are companies that've been around for 15 years, 20 years, 50 years. Take Amway for example. However many years they've been on board, you know, I don't know, 70 years or whatever it is, uh, and they're still going strong. Uh, you know, but you know, a lot of these old school network marketing companies they do appear to be you know d uh, going down because they don't you know they don't seem to be learning what you know what the trend is doing and live good is right at the forefront of the trends they understand people's shopping needs people's buying habits you know we we've, we've got we've got an absolute network marketer's dream here where we're able to make incredible amount incredible, incredible money in, incredible monthly income checks um but but still by promoting products that are you know cheaper and more affordable than what any other network marketing company is doing. You know, I mean, look at other network marketing companies where you've got the single mother trying to trying to make ends meet 
um, not getting the support that she needs, but she can come on board with something like a network marketing company here at LiveGood and get access to affordable products. But she's not she's not she's not uh, required to buy the products if she doesn't need need to, or she can buy what she needs. But the great news is that these are products that everyone needs, and we've figured that out. We found that out, you know, because of COVID. Um, people are starting to wake up to the fact around the world that uh, health is important. I've woken up to that fact. You know, I haven't ha- I haven't been ill for the last three years plus four years. You know, I haven't had the the regular cold that, that I used to get for about four years. I've just been completely you know healthy and I've lost a lot of weight and I feel incredibly good from it. And it's come and it's and it's um, you know mostly thanks to companies like LiveGood. You know, I had a a plan B before joining LiveGood. So I, I came across Live Good actually in, in August, uh, I think it was summer of 2022. It had already launched in America, but it wasn't global, unfortunately. But I knew, you know, by obviously by this time, I, lo- I knew a lot of this, the, the old skinny body care lot like Tim Miller and people. And I wanted to be a part of this because I feel that they're part, you know, they're kind of very special to me. You know, Tim is part of the family, you know, and uh, I want to see what Tim's up to. And I and he was getting excited about LiveGood, and I wanted to join, but I couldn't because it wasn't available in the you know it, it, around the world. But I knew I figured I, I had a feeling that LiveGood was going to go global, and I was right. And I kept my eye on the company. In December 2022, it went global, and boom, I was on board. Um, and I wouldn't have known about it if if Tim was quiet, if Tim Miller was quiet about all this. And and that's what I say, you know. Guys, I knew that right from the beginning. I said, if I'm going to be quiet about this, I'm not going to be able to build it. And the reason why I've got 90,000 plus members in my downline is because I wasn't quiet. Yes, I'm shy. I'm an introvert. I, I am truly shy, guys. You know, if you'd if you'd have pitched me on a network marketing company 10 years ago or, you know, before I started a YouTube channel and before I'd sort of grown and, um, you know, ad- adapted to to what would be needed in order to buy build a global network marketing organization if you'd known me back then i had changed so much and it's thanks to network marketing that's changed me you would have you would have prejudged me and said crikey you know i'm not the kind of person that would join a network marketing business and you would be right but and as a vehicle you know think about think about this guys as a vehicle you know what did i have i mean i was dyslexic you know i started out as a cook um, because I feel I didn't have the choices that I wanted in order to, you know, make my dreams come true. But network marketing came along, and that was the only thing that could really, you know, make, allow me to succeed, regardless of my dyslexia, regardless of my, you know, what I, you know, my sh- my shyness, my um, my uh, in, my the fact that I'm an introvert. Um, and finally, you know, I became a good network marketer because I realized that I didn't have any choices. I didn't have many choices. And yes, you know, we have lots of nice people out there and, you know, try, trying to praise me up and say, you know, you have many choices. You're, you know, you can do anything. And yes, you're right. But I'm glad I found network marketing because it makes sense. You know, I am a, a, a loving kind of guy. I like the sharing aspect of network marketing. I like the family side of network marketing. I like, you know, I like, I, I'm a, I'm a, I'll be honest with you guys. I'm a lonely guy in Japan. I don't have that many friends in Japan. Um, I have some good friends, but uh I like network marketing because it brings people together. You know, it brings really solid people together who are on a on a, you know on the same dreams, the same path, the same journey, and they're willing to get into the trenches and work um, and partner up. And I just love that about network marketing. There's a got there's a lot of good air, a good atmosphere to network marketing. I love it. And uh, LiveGood is really really at the forefront of this new this new this new emerging network marketing style. Um, and I hope, you know, I, I mean, I, you know, I know that LiveGood is going to do well, obviously, but I hope, you know, maybe other companies, are, you know, are, li- are likely to follow suit. And I think that would be a good thing, you know, if LiveGood being the pioneer, but uh, other companies suddenly starting to realize. Um, but uh, the good news is that LiveGood is bringing out other products. You know, we've got, you know, other whole household type products. We're not just going to be um, health and wellness down the road. You know, Amazon started with books. And now look, um, Live Good started with health and wellness, but uh, you know we've we've already got you know over twenty plus products in the pipeline that you don't even know about. 
Okay, some of them you do know about, but I'm not talking about those. I'm not. I'm not talking about the uh, the essential oils that we know about. They're coming out before December, before Christmas. I'm not talking about the other stuff, the gummies that that for the children. You know, the health gummies for the children that they're going to love, and they and 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 they already we already know that children love them because they've already been tested. Um, you know, you know, in the proper way. You know, but uh, you know a lot of those products are already on, in the making. We've got a new version of the E3, which is the energy drink we used to have, but this is a new version, an upgraded version of the E3. Um, looking forward to that. It was, um, it was, it was a great product, but uh, this is going to be even better. So a number of things are coming. But in addition to that, there are twenty additional products in the pipeline that we don't even know about. Okay, that you know, and Ben Glinsky gave us a hint like skincare and uh, you know other things. Um, but anyway, I don't want to make this video too long. But guys, if you want to really launch your business, you've just got to get in the back office. Just uh, you know, get to know the air, get to know everything that we've got in here, such as the webinar schedules. Um, you know, we've got a seven day fast start guide that you can share out. You don't even need to set this up because there are no links that you need to brand. You know, this this button here goes to the to the video, but there's there's no join link. You know, they're all like the PDF presentation downloads. Get into the group. Um, the telegram channel uh other groups that you can get connected with uh the important videos to to look at and you can go through the whole seven day fast start guide this is how we duplicate you'll be able to get into the to the facebook group that i've um sorry that's my um that's my uh channel <clears throat> but um get into my facebook group this is my private group we've got almost seven thousand people in here already um and uh, people are bring, you know, we're all putting in a lot of good, good info updates, rec you know, some good graphics. Um, people are to really, people are really helping to provide great value in the group. Um, so it's a very active group, and really, really love the group. So you'll get everything you need um, so that you can start your live good journey. But this is a family, guys. This is not, tr you know, like a, you know, get on board for a month and test it, test the waters, and then. You know, if it doesn't work out for me, uh, I'm going to leave and join something else. That's not what this is, <laughs> guys. Yes, there's going to be some struggle. But, uh, you know, being a part of a family, just coming to the simply coming to terms with the fact that, you know, um, th that once you've once you've understood that these products are what we really need, you know, I mean, not, heck, you know, if, if the products are not something you need and you care about and you don't care about health or, or wellness or whatever, and bearing in mind there are other products coming on, as I mentioned, but, uh, you know, sure. But I think, you know, as, as long as you've, as long as you come to terms with the fact that these are products that you need and you, and, and regardless of whether, you, whether you're able to actually generate success in your first month or not, just be just be happy with the fact that you've got access to incredible products. Um, you know, and the reason why I say that is because, you know, people are, you know, I know people are on a budget, you know, some people are struggling. But guys, you know, I would have, you know, with or without Live Good, if Live Good didn't even exist, I would still be buying products at a more, at a more expensive rate you know, at my local supermarket or whatever. And I'd rather not buy out of local supermarkets because they put all kinds of junk in there that you don't want. But uh, I had been buying these kind of products, my multivitamins um, and and other stuff that uh, I needed, like the protein powder. But uh, I'm glad I'm able to get them, at, uh, you know, like the protein powder, for example, organic, you know, organic whole protein powder, which is, uh, you know, no, no added sugar and other things, you know, that uh, typically you get in commercial products <clears throat> here you get it all healthy and stuff and you still get it at a reasonable price but guys you know you're not you're not required you're not forced to buy the products so uh you know you've got to you just be okay with the fact that you're on board with a company regardless of not you know even if you're not able to cover your costs by, by you know with a team that because you haven't been able to build your team yet it doesn't matter but uh you know guys anyone can build up to bronze level within days Okay, it's all it takes is just bring in two people, one on each leg. Okay, and some people are just bringing in, you know, another member of their household, or maybe two members of their household. Um, and then that makes them bronze. You know, but we can all, we, you know, we've all got people we can communicate with, whether it's online and or offline. And even if we feel we haven't, you can still network with people, you can get into groups on Facebook, you can, uh, network with people you, you know you're going to be getting people coming into your inbox 
you can have a conversation with them and turn the turn turn it around so that you you know you get them to have a look at what you've got be relentless you know be hardcore you know absolutely go in go all in and uh, hammer this out there um get you know get beyond your kind of you know your your reservations your shyness your uh you know you just got to get all get all out there and uh you know do whatever it takes honestly guys um and if you're not able to do that and you don't feel comf- comfortable about doing that you've just got to re- revisit your reason why you know dream building is absolutely essential it really is put up your pictures of things you need i mean don't just you know don't just think about it half-heartedly and think oh well i you know it'd be nice to have a house or it'd be nice to have a car i did that and nothing nothing really worked for me because i actually to be honest with you guys i don't actually like driving that much you know i'm not really into you know driving or fast cars and i and i tried doing that and it just something didn't didn't click for me but uh once you really spend hours on your dreams and really go into stuff in detail, what you really want and how much it's going to cost and put your figures, um, it gets really quite fun. You can be very creative. Um, and that's when things really start to turn around for me. And I think people ask me, what's my secret? What what am I doing that you know they need to ad- adapt? It's not, It's got nothing to do with marketing systems. It's got nothing to do with strategy or whatever. But it's got 100% to do with your dreams and uh, aspirations and what's important to you because you know once you've got the dream in place that's so strong you know you rank it right up there with oxygen once it's so strong in your mind nothing's going to stop you and you know you'll just you'll just and think about it guys all you need is facebook you know take tim miller for example that's all he uses he doesn't use youtube he doesn't use marketing systems in fact i know for a fact that tim miller bless him he's uh He's not your te- he's not your most technical guy that's for sure um and um and 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 I say that you know with with um, affection because I love the guy you know and it's kind of it's kind of funny thinking you know that uh, such a such an incredible leader um does does it in such a simple way and he has incredible success but you know, and, and I look at a lot of the other diamonds and the, a lot of the other leaders in the company, and none of them are really, you know, using the you know any any fancy marketing third-party marketing tools or anything like that, or systems or setting up lead capture pages or anything like that. They're just taking full advantage of what we already have access to. Everybody's already on Facebook, guys. That's really you know, if if I was going to boil down one tool, uh, as and say what is the tool, it's got to be Facebook. Um, and I say that, you know, although I actually personally, I actually have more success with, with YouTube than I do with Facebook. But the reason why I say Facebook is because that's the platform that's really a lot more duplicatable. Nobody, nobody can really, you know, truly make excuses. People do make excuses about not using Facebook. Um, but you know, it's, it's, none of it's valid. And, I, and I'll and I'll go right in their face and say that you know people do make excuses, but none none of it's you know I, I I don't pay any attention to any of it really. I used to be like that, you know. Trust me, guys. I I stayed well away from Facebook, um, and I regret doing that really. But in spite of that, I I knew that I you know I I knew that in order to get started, some one some in some way, shape or form, I had to do something, and whatever it was going to be, I had to go all in on that method. And and actually, it, it was it was YouTube that I went in, went all in on, and in spite of my shyness, um, I just put that behind me. You know, I'm not, nobody's asking you just just to get on the phone. I mean, you know, back old school network marketing days, all we had was the phone. But uh, you know, those days are over. You know, we don't necessarily need to use the phone um, in order to be successful. Um, we've got other other methods, and I'm saying that if you can just really network with people and go crazy, go all in. It's like, you know, it, it, it's all relative, you know, like Jim Rohn says, you know, um, what what I lack in skill, I can make up in numbers. And Facebook is scalable. You can scale Facebook up unlimited. Um, so, you know, if if you're going to turn around and say to me, well, I spoke to 20 people on Facebook today and nobody said yes. OK, double it. OK, well, then if you come to me and said I spoke to 50 people and nobody joined me. OK, double it. You know, I can always just say to you, double it, double it, double it. And you're going to hate me for it. But it's true, guys. Facebook is scalable. And one way or another, 
you're going to have to figure it out. And trust me, once you keep doing it, you're going to get better at it naturally. Nobody's going to be able to teach you how to get better at it. You just just by doing it, doing it, doing it every single day. Trust me, you will get better at it. Okay, and then your your numbers, your averages are gonna, it, you know, you're gonna decrease, and you're gonna be able to get a, a sign up into your live good business with fewer, you know, people, you know, to, speaking to fewer people. So you know your your averages of conversion are gonna gonna naturally reduce, you know, because you're gonna naturally get better. Anyway, we've been over thirty minutes. I'm sorry, guys, but I just really feel that I wanted to cover everything here in absolute detail. So that you guys have exactly what what what's needed, you know. We're we're not gonna we're not always just gonna be kind and and just nice. The difference between being nice and kind, okay. I, I can't be nice all the time because you just got to hear what you got to hear. You know, if I was just I was just gonna be kind, you're gonna quit. You're gonna give up, and and some people will quit and give up. But la- thank goodness, you know, we 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 don't we're not we're not gonna be successful with hundreds of people you know yes we might have to get in front of hundreds of people in order to find a few key leaders that are that are going to be responsible for making us millionaires you know even if it's just three people is all you need to get you to diamond okay so far i found two people and i got one more person who's emerging um and uh, who's almost platinum and he's a good friend Okay, but you know, three three people is really all I was looking for in order to get to diamond, and that that's the truth, guys. So you can go diamond on three people, but I, yes, you can see me at number seven on the leaderboard, and I've 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 worked with a lot of people. Some people really are passionate about the business, and they're showing me. You know, they you know I see people going bronze, silver, gold, platinum. You know, they're working way up. They're they're way, they're way out the ranks. And it's amazing to see that. But uh, at the end of the day, guys, <clears throat> you know, we are looking for a few key people. Um, but we need to get in front of, you know, hundreds of people potentially in order to find those. And a lot of those hundreds of people may not even join you. They might they might abuse you, might hate you. They, they'll, a lot of them will give you no's, not interested or whatever. But the people who are, you know, who are kind of interested, you've got to be following up with them. You've got to be in their inbox. Okay, so sift out the people who are just time wasters and get with the people who are ready to, you know, even at least take a look. Okay, and just follow up, follow up, follow up and just build up that relationship and you will find your key people. All right. Thanks for thanks for watching, guys. um, And I appreciate you all. uh, And we'll, we'll see you on the inside. Bye for now.